turn fully to the side. <laughs> so bad. to our incredible room actually just take a look at this what is this bed um we've got a mickey on this just whatever that day bed i suppose it is but then i walked in oh my god i'm a sweaty mess i walked into this bathroom oh mood lighting and this is what we have what is this i love it i was not expecting this this place is literally $50 a night. I don't understand how that's possible, but I guess welcome to Thailand. And we've just been on traveling for, I mean, it was only a nine hour flight, but it took us a lot longer to get here um, with delays and stuff. So we're finally here. So we have just woken up. It is raining outside, but honestly not a surprise because it is wet season, but it will like rain on and off. I assume, but how sick is this? This is the view outside, and there's literally like a pool the entire way around. There's the bathroom. Um, yeah, this pool just goes around the whole hotel. And there's like mountains and stuff. It's just really tropical and humid, and I'm so about it. So we just went for breakfast, and we asked for like a late checkout, just like a little bit later, because they told us we could do it last night when we checked in, and. Um, Michael looked at like the, he saw like the list of the rooms that were booked and it was literally eight rooms booked in the entire resort, which is super sad because that kind of just means that like no one's here after COVID or like people aren't traveling yet, which makes sense. But yeah, it's just kind of crazy that it's still like, how can a place survive off having eight rooms booked? actually no. this is so sick this is the island we're staying at i think it's called koyo yao or something damn we've arrived in paradisi and this is we're in like a jungle but also like i'll show you i've probably already shown you what the beach part of it looks like when we walked on and let's do the room reveal mickey Ooh. oh it's it's it cooled like as well Indian. smells so woody <gasps> They did it. Oh, that is so sweet. He's bloody. It's very little uniform. Oh, let me just close the door so we don't have a monkey. As we walked in, there was a monkey. That lady said monkeys come. There's a bath, another day bed, and look at this. Oh. What? This is insane. Super pretty. I'm obsessed with this like wood look. So nice. Just a full bathroom to just stand. Also in the shower, you can like obviously do this and it looks out to another Mickey. I don't think I've ever stayed in a place this nice in my damn life. A little croissant with the hair tied up. <laughs> little rabbi. Oh, no way. A little babies. Oh, hello. There's a little albino one. Hi, little. I've never seen a baby rabbit. That is so cute. Oh my God. Look this one. This is like the little garage you get on to go up the like monstrous hill
ready, do it. And I'll put the hand over it. Ready? One, two, three. One, two, three. <laughs> we'll try again. <laughs> ready? One, two, three. <laughs> I keep missing. Okay, ready? One, two, three. Yeah. Got to the island, did a big walk around, um, went up and down on these uh, like car things because it's super steep. They've got such incredible like views from all different angles of this place. It is so sick. It is a tropical island that like resort exactly what it is. But I've just never been I've never been somewhere like this before. It is super special, super unique. The wood furnishings and decoration design everywhere is just amazing like we had dinner down on the beach and now we're just gonna go to bed because we are wrecked i feel like i haven't had a proper sleep in days and i actually haven't yesterday was pretty bad um getting from the other hotel to here it was just a bit confusing because like people didn't want to pick us up um because like of the taxi mafia and apparently like where we were staying was right next to a taxi mafia like spot or something told everywhere that it's our anniversary and they also got us a freaking cake like just as we got into the room and like saw our message that was on the bed earlier that you would have seen they brought us this cake i'm just gonna pull it out we haven't eaten it yet but how cute is that Ha ha ha, divine. Good morning, Ko Yao Yo. Ko Yo Yao, something along those lines. This is the balcony, and we're about to go to Breca Fast. <laughs> Yeah, I do. I got eggs, Benny, chocolate croissant, waffles, croissant with ham and cheese, some cakes. Yum. And this is like a iced chocolate, so damn delicious. It's pretty like bitter until you put sugar in it, but it's delicious then. Just riding some bikey boys. Doing that. Little bloody Hondas. Couple of is mine a Hondi? All right, let's do this. It's like Schweppes. It's sort of like, it um... Oh, it is Schweppes. can of tastes like Mountain Dew a little bit, honestly. Oh, divine. Yeah. 
shit, nah, mate, I'm gonna get a fucking spider tattoo behind my fucking ear in Thailand here, now that I fucking ride bikes and that. Yeah, fucking cheers, cunt. Look at this rain, that's so sick. It's like moved, it was over near these little fellas, as Michael will call them, and it's moved over to here. And we're leaving the island today, which is probably the perfect time to leave after we went bike riding and Michael very sunburnt. <laughs> very sunburnt, man. <laughs> Another day, another anniversary. That's all I've got to say. This is the Novotel. It is super cute. I love, whoa, look at that shower. And out here, very city-like, but this is Phuket City, old town. We're now in um, Old Town, which is in Phuket, and it's just got all these really like, super cute old buildings that like, you can sort of see these like colourful ones at the end. Very quiet. I don't know if that's normal again. Everywhere has been pretty quiet though, to be honest. This street is so pretty. I'm obsessed with it. It's called the Lang Road, I'm pretty sure. So nice. Somebody's very sunburned. We're going to pee pee. pee. Tsunami hazard zone. Oh my god, I hate seeing that. That is our hotel there behind. There's cats everywhere here. I love it. It's so cute. There's another one. And there's another one. It's here. This tail is like a love heart. That is so cute. I mean, it's probably deformed, and that's why it's like that, but you're very cute. has gone completely out we're just chilling Mickey's always got camera in hand ready to take 500 photos we're having a bloody bevy and I'm eating some pad thai Michael what are you having um pizza baked duck tom ka with noodles mm. love it You are covered in fucking grease. This is delicious. It's like mixed berry, yogurt, alcoholic beverage of some description. It is so hot right now. And I love the heat, but this is the hottest it has been this entire like trip. And I'm eating a very hot pad thai, like not spicy, just boiling hot. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Hey, look. Little Luigi, Luigi. Hi, would you like a piece? Hey, there you go. No? So very niche reggae beatbox. <laughs> How much for this one? Aww, how much for this one?
morning and it was so delicious. It tasted like fresh coconut too. It wasn't like gross and like, I don't know, fake tasting. So yum. And they like toast it for you. So good. I want to try all of them, especially this one. Shredded pork with salad cream in a croissant. Oh, sandwich. Amazing. I love all Asian countries, 7 Eleven, so so much better than ours. Sorry I haven't updated you. Basically we came on the boat over here and we're spending basically just 24 hours here um, after we were in Phuket City yesterday. And we ended up at like some beach party and it was wild to say the least. We saw some crazy things. Very R-rated things in the water that I was not expecting. I was really hot so I went for a swim and then some people just started skinny to me and then there were just all these people all these naked people in, in the beach outside this club and i danced for so long but paying for it today just got some bloody maccas to eat one pie one pie pineapple pie cheesy bib teriyaki pork burger i'm pretty sure it's the same one as in japan can't wait. Just sitting on the bed. Yeah. There's nowhere else to sit. And it's our anniversary again. Oh, they did not. They got us a cake. Aww. What type of cake is that? <laughs> We just got back from um, like walking around Patong and it was just hectic and I'm really hungover and I don't want to be there. So then I was like, let's go get some snackies from 7-Eleven and we got some yummy snacks. So hopefully that will make me feel a lot better. Um, so to begin with, this one I am really excited about. Some sort of my glow poom situation. I don't know what it is. Milo ice cream, love Milo. Chocolate cereal. Uh, in a bag filled with cream. Yum! Like little chippies. And I also love pandan, so I got little pandan and coconut wafer. Mm -hmm. That was all I got because I ate lots of dinner. There's already... one with beverage. I got a little beverage, a little nightcap. Mm -hmm. It's not Thai at all, it's 100% German, but little uh, raspberry weiss beer. Delicious. Little raspberry wheat beer. Um, I got some chicken skin, like chips, I suppose. Cracker open. Um, they look wild, not for the vegans or vegetarians, obviously. Not for some, Mickey. Not for Mickey. Just some little, like, I guess, kind of like some sort of Oreo sort of cookie, but with like mini with little chocolate cream. These little like strawberry and cream cookies. This chocolate breaks up. It's like a caramel wafer chocolate thing. Gum. And then some like wafery thing here. We had Milo ice cream, right? Mmm. Taste, tastes like that. Maybe I can hit the Cume. inside. The cume. It's just Milo ice cream, which is yum. I love Milo ice cream. I love beer. All right, we'll check back in when we try something else. I'm just a bit tired. Yum. We are like having the sunniest day so far. It is so damn hot. I the, wish I could tell you how hot it is. The weather forecast said it was like thunderstorm every day. Every the whole single time we've day. Been here, and it's been sunny sun every single day, which is perfection. But um, this is definitely the sunniest and hottest day, and we're at Patong. This is our first day at Patong. Um, and eight. Um, just eight. Thank you, yeah, you too. Thank you too. 
Wow, that's hilarious that you just got that on camera. People yelling at me everywhere I go. We're trying to look for a motorbike, but I don't know how that's going to go. Anyway, I'm very full. We just had buffet. Michael forever getting, he's too nice. He gets pulled in to chat to every goddamn person. 20 minutes each time. He won't listen to me. He won't just say no thank you. He's got to stand and chat to every Fucking hell, Michael. Every goddamn time. <laughs> every time been left in the suit shop all alone. Michael's getting two suits. from 7-Eleven. filled with melted cheese. Very sunburnt man speaks into the camera. It's so good though. So this one is um, peanut butter, banana, and like condensed milk drizzle over the top and is so fucking good. Best roti I've ever had in my entire life. I look 
so ridiculous, but we're about to go for a little ride along the beachfront for like up to like all the different beaches. Um, it's our first really dreary day, so we'll see how this goes. I'm terrified if it rains. There he is. Just gonna eat some durian. I've never tried it before, which I feel like is weird. Oh no, we don't have it, do we? I Not feel like really. we don't. Alright, either you have to hold it or I have to hold it. We accidentally sniffed it already and I think it just smells like mango to be honest. Smell it again. Oh it smells pretty brutal. It smells kinda of like onion. It smells like mango, like a very, very ripe mango. Extremely ripe mango. I reckon it's gonna taste like mango for sure. Mm. Who's bite it? I guess Cheers. so. Cheers. Oh, I hate that. Mm. Yeah, I'm not a fan. It tastes like meat. It kind of tastes like an onion to me. It's not for me. Oh, that's so gross. This, this smell is better than the taste. Everyone yeah. says it's the opposite way. You're all fucking liars. Guess where we are yet again at Mickey's absolute favorite. I can't find a sign, but we're at, oh, there. Sev Pine, Alev Pine. And he's sitting down and eating meal because it's, it's the first vegan one that he has found. Because normally it's just like chicken and pork. It'll be like almost possible to be vegetarian and then they'll just throw some like shrimp on the top or they'll throw some shredded boiled chicken on some like fried rice that would 100% be better and then just like boom, have a little bit of this on top. Hopping on. I just had a beautiful lunch slash but funny that they dinner. You, you get the vegan meal but they still throw in a packet of fish sauce with it as well. <laughs> Maybe it's vegan fish sauce. Yeah. A delicious dinner, lunch, it was like lunch, of um, crab and a coconut and it was delicious. And I'm so full. Actually I had two crabs. It started pouring rain, that's why we're wearing this, these hideous raincoats. But Michael's just going to sit here and eat this and then we will oh, move on to the next, I don't know, we can't really ride the bike because we'll probably die in this weather. So we're just gonna maybe go back to the hotel and we can ride it a little bit tonight. We shall see. We came to the Thai boxing and Joe Rogan is here. <laughs> Isn't it broken? <laughs> Wow. <laughs> wow. That's how the layers work. Mm. That makes sense actually, because it's like that's how it comes in, uh, in a packet, is like that with folds in it. Does it? Yeah. It's got that stuff on it mm. too. Look at it fresh.
Frank of fast today. Nine for nine. I didn't eat omelets before, and now I eat omelets because they have just been so bloody delicious They've every single so day. They've been so good. Completely converted. Mmm. Great. Great. So much physical exertion. It easy for him though. Yeah, yeah, you <laughs> This was like a garlic to garlic bread on the outside and cheese toasty. Mickey got a cheese toasty. And I got this um they're doing like a couple of vegan meals and stuff and this is like vegan crispy pork with like chili and garlic and sauteed spinach maybe. Delicious. Bloody delicious. This is a croissant sandwich with spinach, cheese and ham in it. The vine, and then we got the classic pandan, which I think we may have oh. already shown you. So pandan sand, sand. Amazing. Pandan sand. Um, and then we got some. These are just out of control, good. They're so good. Um, cooking cream coffee. I'm gonna go get our bag. <laughs> 